Hello everyone. Welcome to PU Maths. ABC is a three digit number in which the digit A is greater than digit B and digit C. If the difference between ABC and CBA is 297 and the difference between ABC and BAC is 450, then find all possible three digit numbers ABC and also find their sum. This question is from NMTC examination. If you are interested to solve this problem, you can pause this video now and try to solve. Otherwise, let's begin to solve this problem. It is given that ABC minus CBA is equals to 297. Here, in the first ABC, A is in 100 place, B is in 10th place and C is in 1's place. So, by writing according to their places, we can write 100A plus 10B plus C minus 100C plus 10B plus A is equals to 297. It is given that A is greater than C. So, there must be carry in that unit place. So, we can write that 10 plus C minus A gives us 7 in that unit place which results a minus c is equals to 3 let's say it has equation 1 it is also given that abc minus bac is equals to 450 let's write these digits with respect to their places then we have 100a plus 10b plus c minus 100b plus 10a plus c equals to 450. c minus c gives us 0. Then in the tens place we have 10b minus 10a is equals to 5. And we know that digit a is greater than digit b. It means there must be a carry over from that tens place to hundreds place. Then we can say that 10 plus b minus a gives us 5. By simplifying this, we have a minus b is equals to 5. Let's say it has equation 2. From equation 1 and equation 2, we can write c minus b is equals to 2. Let's say it has equation 3. We know that digit a is greater than b and digit a is greater than c. From equation 3, we can say that C is greater than B. Now, let's find all possible three-digit numbers ABC. Let's first put A is equals 9. We know that A minus B gives us 5. So, if we substitute A is equals 9, then the value of B becomes 4. And also, we know that C minus B gives us 2. So, if we substitute B is equals 4, then the value of C becomes 6. So, the three digit number is 946. Let's verify whether ABC minus CBA gives us 297 or not. So, 946 minus 649 gives us 297. So, which satisfied. Then, let's check out ABC minus BAC gives us 450 or not. So, 946 minus 496 gives us 450. Now, let's take in the second case, A is equals 8. If we substitute A is equals 8, then the value of B becomes 3 and the value of C becomes 5. So, here also, let's find out ABC minus CBA. So, 835 minus 538 gives us 297 and 835 minus 385 gives us 450. Here also condition satisfies. Then let's substitute A is equal 7 in the third case. If we substitute A equals 7, then the value of B becomes 2 and the value of C becomes 4. So, 724 minus 427 gives us 297 and 724 minus 274 gives us 450. So, case 3 also satisfies. In the case 4, let's substitute A is equal 6 then the value of B becomes 1 and the value of C becomes 3. 
So ABC is equal 613. 613 minus 316 gives us 297. And 613 minus 163 gives 450. So case 4 also satisfies the condition. Now let's move on to case 5. In the case 5, let's substitute A is equals 5. If we substitute A equals 5, then the value of B becomes 0 because A minus B is equals to 5. If we substitute B is equal to 0, then the value of C becomes 2. Now let's check that condition. ABC minus CBA. So 502 minus 205 gives us 297, which satisfies the condition. Then let's check out whether that ABC minus BAC gives us 450 or not. So ABC value is 502 minus BAC value is 052 which gives us 450 but it is given that BAC is a three digit number. In the case 5 we have BAC value as 052 which is a two digit number. So we can't take the value of A as 5, B as 0 and C as 2. So the possible three digit numbers A, B, C are 946, 835, 724 and 613 and their sum is 946 plus 835 plus 724 plus 613 gives 3118. That is the answer. I hope you all got this answer. Thank you for watching the video.